Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another episode of Hollow Knight. I'm actually recording this like in the middle of the night right after episode 6 came out, so that's pretty exciting. What are we gonna do? I have no idea. So in the comments of episode 6, Levi left a lot of different suggestions for me. So I guess I might give some of those a shot. One thing he told me to do is check out the stone sanctuary here. Another thing he told me to do is check on Myla. He requested that I go check on everybody's favorite, Willow. He'd also mentioned that Deep Nest was a lot larger, so I could explore that as well. Levi was also telling me that the map for the resting grounds was in Cornifer's shop. Apparently Cornifer just doesn't show up in the resting grounds or something. And while Levi didn't expressly tell me this, I did notice while editing that I had said that I had explored this area when I in fact did not. So I could go and explore that later as well. Couple that with the fact that we still haven't explored the Royal Waterways and that makes for quite a lot to do. I don't know, I guess we'll sort of figure stuff out as we go, huh? What's up, is Zelda? <sighs> there we go, there's the resting grounds map. Oh, and couple of pins too. Whispering root pin. Cornifer has been telling me about these strange whispering roots he's been seeing. I made some pins so you can record their locations yourself. And warrior's grave pin. Cornifer told me he's found some interesting looking graves and shrines in the depths. You can use these pins to mark down any interesting graves on your map. Go and pay your respects. I'm pressing the F button as hard as I can right now. Okay, well, I guess I have enough geo to buy it all, so let's just do that. Alright. Thank you, Aselda. Okay, so I think the easiest thing to start with is going to be checking on Willow, and then the second easiest thing is probably heading up to the Stone Sanctuary right after. So I'm going to go do stuff in that order. Be back in a second. So what Levi was telling me specifically is that Willow had some really funny dialogue if you dream nail her. So I'm just going to do that real quick. This little creature looks tasty. I wonder should I eat it? The others around here were awfully bland. Uh huh. What the fuck, Levi? <laughs> That's not funny. That's fucked. Jesus fucking Christ. That's so mean. Why would you make me look at that? What the hell? And thus the night's visits to Willow suddenly ended. <laughs> Alright, we're heading up to Green Path. Okay, now that I have my Lumafly Lantern, this shouldn't be as bad as it was before. Alright, here we go. Stone Sanctuary. Oh, this is way better. Oh my god. Yeah, now I can totally see where I'm going. This is really open. A lot of dead bugs here, too. Oh, hey, what's up, homie? My child. Can you still see? Please, don't hurt me. Can't sleep. With your eyes open, little one, can't dream, if you're still breathing, little one. Precious children, you speak such loathsome things as you sleep, your claws scratch and scrape. Precious children, a monster's come for us in the dark, will you sing for me? Challenge the warrior dream? Levi, what the fuck are you asking me to do every episode? <laughs> Okay, the warrior dream, let's... Oh, God. What is this? Oh, God. What the fuck is this music? I am literally just, like, kind of... Ah! Okay. Ow. Uh, this is like the weirdest boss fight I've ever had, man. I guess it reminds me a lot of like those soul twisters or whatever you call them. Like the little magic dudes or whatever right before, uh... Uh, what was he called? Soul Master? Yeah, that's the guy. Ah! Not where I wanted to go, but here we are. Uh, uh, oh god! <laughs> Okay. Come on, no eyes. Ow, how am I getting hit with, by a person with no eyes? This is BS, man. Their attacks are moving faster, too, I've noticed. 
That's sweet. Oh, God. Mm. Ow. I didn't get hit by anything, but I said ow anyway. Because I felt like it. And then I got hit by something there. I didn't say ow. Because I felt like it. Ow. Okay, that time I did get hit. Oh my god, dude, I'm getting owned. Dude, I'm getting owned. Okay. Grub song is literally OP. Oh my god. What is this? This is the weirdest fight I've ever had. Get over here. <laughs> this is like so much of me just like running around aimlessly. Like I'm probably going to have to abridge some of this. Oh my... Mm. Getting so mad. Get over here. Oh my god. Uh, no. No. Oh, oh my god. I don't know how I survived that. I definitely do not deserve to be alive right now. Okay. Oh my god. I'm getting owned. Okay. Heal, heal, heal. Um, okay. That didn't do anything for me, did it? Oh my god, oh my god, heal, 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 heal. Heal. Where are you? Where are you? Oh my god. Heal. Oh my god, get over here. I need, like, long nail or something, dude. Ugh. Oh, I got him. Oh, heal. <laughs> How? How did I do that? Oh, that was a fucking fight and a half, huh? One by one, their eyes closed at last. I felt it, a warm stillness falling over us. I'm sorry I was frightened of you. You were always protecting us, even when we couldn't see you. Take us there, please. A place where light cannot haunt us. A place without dreams. Please. What in the hell? Uh, um, okay. Inspect. A face carved from stone. Huh, did I get essence from that, by the way? I thought I had 20, and now it looked like I had 220. Editor me, can you, like, put on screen how much essence I had? Thanks. Alright, what's further on this way? There's a lot of spikes. Oh, I guess there's some sort of ability I need. I guess I can't go further into this until I have some sort of ability to jump higher, maybe? I don't know. But, uh, I guess I just did a fight. That was weird. Oh, wait, no, I can go up this way. <laughs> don't need to be smart. Just need to be cool. Alright, here we go. That seems like a bad idea waiting to happen. Anything up this way? Ah, there's a little path. This way. Cool. Oh! I really don't like where we're at. This is super foggy. Dude, all of a sudden, I love where we're at. <laughs> Oh my god. Heck yeah. Okay, we got another mask shard. Can I jump up here? No, it doesn't look like it's gonna let me. <laughs> that would have been really funny though, huh? I can stand here though, which is kind of interesting. Alright, well, off we go. Okay, so even though I wasn't told that it was a freaking boss fight in there, I did get a mask shard out of it, so I guess I'm not complaining. Thanks, Levi. See, for every suggestion, like Willow, that Levi's gonna do, He's gonna give me one like the uh, stone sanctuary, so it's all good. Wait, why is there an opening over there? Are you able to climb up that high? That'd be crazy. Okay, so I think my next play is to head over to the King Station and then just connect these two points here so I can access basically everything on this side, including the resting grounds above, just from the regular side of the City of Tears that I've come to know. It'll be exciting, I'm sure. But yeah, I guess I'll see you guys over at the King Station. Alright, and welcome to the King Station. Uh, some other advice Levi had given me was to dream nail what you can, so I'm gonna just do that real quick. I tire so easily now, and my old legs seem to ache more and more. Still, I'm lucky to grow old at all. So many others haven't. I guess dream nailing just gets you, like, some extra dialogue or something. Apparently you can dream nail enemies, too? That sounds pretty hardcore, but maybe we'll give that a shot. You want my Geo? 
Yes, Quest Nandy, I do want your Geo. So I guess we can go to the other side of the City of Tears just from either the top or bottom entrance. Okay, so this guy really scared the ever-loving piss out of me last time, so... See how that goes. Oh, I was right. Oh my god, he does double damage. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Maybe this is safer. Ugh, it's probably best to take a safer route. What's in here? Oh my fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my Jesus. <sighs> okay, so do I want to attack this guy? That is the big question. I mean, of course I want to. My pride won't let me. Not. We have to save every grub. Every last grub. Okay. Do a little bit of fancy counterattacking. Oh, that hurts so bad. Oh my god, I just got owned. Ow. Oh my god, dude, this guy. What an absolute chad. Alright, well I guess since I got the grub from behind him, it doesn't really matter if I face him anymore. Still though, I'm probably gonna try and take those guys on after I get more nail upgrade stuff, because that sounds pretty dangerous as of now. Gotta sort of stay vigilant here. Kinda sneak past them. <laughs> See, these enemies I can handle. They're just dumb and stupid. Oh, where am I going? <laughs> oh! Speaking of dumb and stupid... Oh, I don't have a map for this area. Great! I'm just gonna head back up. As much as I love not knowing where I'm at, I don't really. Thankfully, the parkour here is pretty easy. So. Um, okay, so I guess I have to go the top route to get where I want. Okay, what's over here? I'm assuming the fountain. Yes. Yes, this is it. We've gained access from the other side. I was wondering how to do this earlier. Now we've done it. There it is. All right, anyway. Enough admiring art. We got other problems to deal with. Okay, I guess we'll just check out what's up here. Hopefully nothing too crazy. You're really not able to do anything over here. You need, like, some sort of high jump to get up there, so... I guess... For now, we're stuck without... I should probably call this elevator up, because it has spikes on the roof. Well, I guess we did a pretty good job for now getting that. I guess while we're here, we can go check out what's on the other side of the resting grounds elevator thing. I don't know. Okay, so supposedly there is something, like, way, way, way up here. I guess I probably won't be able to reach it. Unless I'm a god. Oh, that looked like I could do it. That looked like I could do it. Ow. Ow. Fucking Christ. Ow. What the hell? Ow. Okay, we should have just commit. Damn. Oh my fucking god. Okay, I did it. But, how does that work? Ow. I can get up this way. I guess I can go up pretty high? Yeah, okay. That works. What the fuck is going on? Oh, okay, that's fun. I guess I can go to the other side. But what does that accomplish? Pretty much nothing. Okay, here we go. And I think we did it. Okay. What's over here? Uh, some bat bomber friends. Gotta stay wary of that. This seems really open. 
there it seems kind of useless. All that for just a useless area? Cool. For some reason, this room still isn't showing up on the map, even though I've been there, so I guess I'll leave the marker there for now. There has to be something to do over there. Alright, I guess since I want to do some exploration, I'll just head over to the Royal Waterways, check that out for a bit, see what we can do, and uh, hopefully make some pretty significant progress on that. And down we go. Welcome back to the Royal Waterways. I still don't know where I'm going here, so I'm going to go the opposite of the direction I went last time. Those look like kind of grubbies. <sighs> oh, those are not grubs. <laughs> Okay, pogo wing works very well on them. Get some geo though. That's exciting. Oh, this wall looks like it could be broken. Nice. Uh, what's over this way? This looks dark. Spooky. What the fuck? Uh, hello. Hello, Brett. Mmm. Don't take something if it isn't yours. That's the law. Everything you see, it belongs to me. Don't be angry. I'll share my food with you. If you give me Geo. Purchase food? Um, yeah, I don't want to anger this guy. Seems a little hostile. Mm, this Geo is mine now. Don't try to take it back. Here, take your food with you when you leave. Oh, he threw some food at us. It's a goddamn rancid egg. Are you shitting me? I'll share my food with you if you give me Geo. Wait. Oh, this guy's just gonna give you rancid eggs. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you don't want it, I'll keep it. That guy's gonna give uh, rancid eggs to me, so I don't have to go hunting for him. That's convenient. I would still like to know where Cornifer is, because that would be extremely helpful, but I guess in the meantime, we can just kind of... Explore things without a map. Well, I guess this leads back over to where we were before, because there's the little sign for the bench. Oh, you need Desolate Dive to do this. That's cool. Where am I going? Oh, this bench is sideways. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. That is the goofiest shit, I swear. Oh, that's a fucking weird thing. I don't like that. Oh, it has another stage. I has another stage. What the fuck? Dude, how many stages do you have? You're not Goku. You don't get to just do that. Uh, what's over this way then? Probably not much. No. Ah, Cornifer's pages. I do like seeing those. I actually really like that this guy's in like different phases or whatever. It's pretty interesting. That's a really cool enemy. It's over here. Cornifer? Hello? Okay, there's this humming. For a second I thought I was being tricked into going somewhere I didn't want to be. And to some extent I was. I mean, look at these guys. How do you get the corner for though? That's what I want to know. Oh, I guess you just had to defeat all those guys and this area would open up to you when you grab yourself a good old fashioned map from our good friend Cornifer. Hello. Ho ho, aren't these waterways thrilling? A labyrinth of pipes and tunnels. I couldn't have asked for a better place to employ my talents. It's all so orderly, so considered. Nothing like the crude irregularity of those caverns. Ah, but so sad. My trunk is telling me those fungal wastes are close, and I sense my damp adventure may have reached its end. Guess I'll be calling this map done. Purchase a map? Yeah. That sounds good. So it looks like we've been... Wow, actually quite a ways through. Okay, so that area that we fell down earlier in the episode is actually a part of the Royal Waterways. That's interesting. Didn't know that. Apparently there's an elevator at the bottom that kind of snapped. Alright. I'd wager these pipes and chambers were once used to carry the city's waste. Would have been a horrific stench down here. Thankfully, the constant rain has flushed them to clean. And since Levi told me about dream nailing, let's do that real quick. To chart the world, what joy. Only Zelda could share the thrill. Oh, so he, he knows full well that Zelda isn't sharing in his dream. The fungal wastes. Why am I going to the fungal wastes? 
I don't know. Oh, I remember this area. There was this uh, weird character up here. I have no idea how to get. There has to be a way, right? Huh? Why is that? Why is it making the metal sound? Okay, so there's definitely more to this area than I'm thinking about. I'll have to come back and really, like, ponder how to free this character here. I don't know. That'll probably take some time, but everything in due time, right? I guess since I'm so close to Deep Nest, I should probably give exploring another go. I mean, if things get too hairy, I can always leave. I've got a lot of rancid eggs, so I can just summon my shade back or whatever. No big deal. I just got nervous because Cornifer got nervous, you know? Okay, here we are, back in Deep Nest. We're just gonna make our way through a little bit further this time. I don't really know what's here. God, this ambience really fucking scares the shit out of me. Oh my god, what the fuck, dude. I should not be playing this game in the middle of the fucking night. Oh, uh, that's a lot of noise. Oh, those things are like gome, but scarier looking. We stand a scary looking gome. Whoa, what the fuck? Ow. You piece of shit. Okay, well I can take that guy in three hits, so maybe I can handle some of Deep Nest. I don't know. Deep Nest still kind of scares me, not gonna lie. Where are we? This is such a labyrinth, dude. I guess there's some Geo there if you want to risk your health. I'm not really into that idea as much, but I mean, other people can do it if they want. Let's see. Oh, that's definitely a breakable floor. <laughs> I guess I have to go down it anyway. Damn. I was like, you're not gonna trick me with that one. That's so obvious, but turns out I had to do it anyway. I hate it when that happens, when I'm forced to do something that I didn't want to do anyway. Exploring this place without the Lumafly Lantern would have been, like, so impossible, though. Just imagine. In before, it's, like, totally possible, but I'm just being dumb. Getting past those guys isn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I guess we can follow Cornifer's map up. Uh, that looks like a void. Yeah, no. As much as I love falling into a fucking endless pit. Oh, fungal waste is above. Up here, then, I suppose, is the way. Why am I hearing a fucking minion? Banana! Oh, shit. He's, like, scared now. Can I dream now? Protect the speaker. Well, you kind of did a shitty job of doing that, huh? Blinding, rising, never be empty. What's up, buddy? Ooh, radiant being. We are blessed. Your rays touch us. Your warmth fills us. Hollow Nest is born again, united in your blazing image. Oh. Light is life. Beaming, pure, brilliant. To stifle that light is to suppress nature. Nature suppressed distorts. Plagues. Embrace light. Achieve union. Oh, ah. Uh, what the fuck is this dude's problem? Okay, minion man. Enjoy your time alone. I really don't know what that was about. I'll be honest. Oh, jeez. This time I will not be tricked by the floor. Alright, what's over here? Broken wall? Oh. This is where I got that grub. I guess let me sit at a bench real quick and we can check our progress through Deep Nest. Okay, so it looks like we've explored quite a bit of what Deep Nest will be. Apparently there was a bench there that I didn't see. That was a pretty good adventure through Deep Nest, huh? I guess the last massive thing I can do is check out the Crystal Peak stuff that I still need to do. Talking to Myla and then checking out over here. I can always check out the resting grounds another time. Okay, so I think the entrance to see Myla's over here. Yes, this was it. I feel a disturbance in the forest. There's no singing, what the heck? Myla? Oh. <laughs> Bury my body, cover my shell. What meaning in darkness, yet here I remain. I'll wait here forever. Till light blooms again. Are you okay? Oh. Bury. Body. Cover. Shell. Darkness. No meaning. Dangerous. Still remain light again. Um. Oh yeah, dream now. I can do that. How much longer? 
kill it. How much longer? Dangerous. How much longer? Kill it. How much longer? Kill the empty one. What the fuck? How much longer must I dig? I'm gonna have to think on that whole interaction for a while, I think. That was fucking weird. Levi, why do you tell me to do weird shit? Such a madman. And now I can go down this way. Ah. <gasps> Yay, more rancid eggs. I like those. I know Levi said that Gigi's confessional didn't really have a ton of use, but hey, you know what? It's fine. I think it's useful. Well, how many times have you used it? Well, like zero, but like, shut up. <laughs> I'm sure it has its use. So I think what I'll do is head up to that bench up there. Just kind of have that as a save point in case anything goes wrong. Oh, look at that, another rancid egg. I've got like five now. I don't know if I'm going to use it that much, but at least I have them. In case I feel like doing that. Oh, I can shoot their projectiles. Oh, that's super helpful to know. Oh, that's dope. Okay. Okay, so you can reflect that, which is extremely helpful. Hmm. Okay, so I guess we'll head up. Oh, that's a grub. Oh, you have to go all the way around. Ew. But it unlocks a shortcut, so... Oh, okay, so further down this way. I never actually did this. But if I go down below here, I can rescue that grub. Yeah, there we go. Oh, shoot, I forgot to dream nail them. Apparently you can dream nail grubs if they're still in their jar. Levi told me that bit of information as well. I should show that off when I see a grub next. Oh, I can kill those guys. You just have to be really smart about it. Wait, the, huh? What is this? Shopkeeper's key? I guess I never did come up this way because I was so scared of those, uh... I don't even know what you'd call them, like, gem turtle things? A small brass key made in the likeness of a shopkeeper. That kind of looks like the logo for Sly. Maybe I'll try giving that to him later. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know why I thought I went down this way. I very obviously have not. Like, this is not even familiar looking. What is down here? Oh, yeah. No shit, I haven't been here. There's a fucking gate. Alright, well, let's go see what's over here. This looks a little dangerous, but... Gotta do what you gotta do. I heard a grub. Where's the grub? There is a grub. It's right up there. How do you get that? Ugh. I need, like, some extra boost or something, dude. Ow. Okay, I gotta remember that you can, like, dash out of those. Oh, where am I going? Let's see what this is all about. Lots of lasers everywhere. Ow. Should probably focus on when they're pointing and when they're not. Okay. Yup. Uh, 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 no, no. I'm gonna do this. You're not gonna stop me. Okay, what's down here? Okay, that was fast. And that's not a way back. Huh, I can't jump up there anymore, so I guess I'm stuck down here. Uh, what? Hey, friend. Oh, I don't like that. This feels like a fight. Maybe? Oh. Consume the crystal heart? Hold S while on the ground or clinging to a wall to concentrate the fo- Oh! Wait, 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 wait! Is this like a super dash or something? Uh. I don't want to read all that, but that's interesting dialogue. Oh my god, there's still more. They don't want you getting on top of this guy, doesn't look like. Hey, look at me, I'm doing it anyway. Man, they're really not subtle when they want you to do stuff like this, huh? Oh, this looks like the Wario fart charge. Here we go! Oh, hey, we're back up here. Oh, I bet I could get that grub now. Here we go. Wee. When does this stop? It don't stop. I wonder if you can manually stop it. That might be a good thing to test when I'm not above spikes. Oh, you can stop it with S. Okay. That makes some sense. Grub, what are you thinking? Home. 
Seriously? Is that is that seriously it? Well, I wasn't far off from saying that they didn't think about much. I'll be honest. I guess that irons off quite a bit of what I was looking forward to doing, huh? What to do now, I wonder? I guess we could always go and check over by where Cornifer was. If I recall correctly, there was an area over there I could super dash. Yeah. Alright. Cornifer's left, but these gems have not. And I'll tell you what, man. I want to explore what I can out here. What's over here? Something, probably. And they don't stop coming, and they don't stop coming. Oh, that is super tight. Alright. Gotta fully charge it. Oh! Okay, don't prematurely end it. <laughs> Good idea. Okay, we're getting a better idea of how to use this, I think. Yeah. Yeah. What's this? Uh-huh. That doesn't look precarious as hell. <laughs> Do you trust it, Pie Man? No, I don't fucking trust it. Okay, well, now that I know it goes up and down on its own, fine. I, I think I trust it enough to maybe potentially not screw me over. Oh. Wait. Oh, that's super cool. Okay, so I can just go over to Gigi's place. Hey, girl. I don't know why I decided to talk to her. She was not going to do anything for me new. That's cool. Back to town, I guess. Oh, you're not going to want to fight me, are you? Eh, another wielding a weapon. I suppose you'll be leaving many a corpse in your wake. If you won't spare thought for the dead, at least consider all the extra work you force upon those in my profession. Oh, he's a grave digger. I see. Can I dream nail him? Oh, he died. Uh, listen guys, it's a genocide run, I swear. I meant to do that. But I think with that, we'll end off episode 7. Got a lot done. We've explored a lot of the places Levi suggested in comments of episode 6. As well as some places that he didn't really suggest I go and check out. But overall, not a bad episode. But hey, hopefully you guys enjoyed and you'll stick with me for the next episode of Hollow Knight. Where I probably do something cool. Wait a minute, I have a shopkeeper's key. Hang on. <laughs> We're gonna do something cool real quick. Hey, Sly. Oh. What do you have there? Oh. Why, that's the key to my storeroom. I thought I'd lost it for good. Hmm, did you find it in those old mines, perhaps? Very curious. I've no idea how it ended up in such a remote place. Very honest of you to return it to me. Yes, very kind. And now that I can open my old storeroom up, I can sell you some more of the rare stock that's been gathering dust in there. These items may be a little time-worn, but they still retain their full market value. Very precious stuff. Take a look. Okay. Oh, he's overcharging like hell. Sprint Master. That's a cool looking... Oh, it lets you run faster. <gasps> oh my god. Heavy blow. An elegant key. Wait a minute. Was this that key that goes to Soul Sanctum? I feel like it is. Oh my god, I love Sly. He has more mask shards. I'm gonna buy one. And complete yet another mask. Bam. Look at that. We get seven health now. That's what we like to see. Does he have dream nailed? Wherever you are, whatever it is you do now, I hope you three are looking after yourselves. Oh. He's probably talking about the people who he was, like, having a memory about, I guess, when we first found him. I don't know. But anyway, now that we've gotten that taken care of, hopefully you guys have found this episode a little bit satisfying. But yeah, thank you guys all so much for watching. And, uh, I'll see you guys next time on episode eight of Hollow Knight. Take care.